Hi there. Asriel, the Emerald Sorcerer, is here. Let's play cards. All right, let's see who's next. Scorpio. All right, ooh. What's going on for Scorpio? What is going on for Scorpio? Emotions of desire. Life force energy. Third chakra. So the need to do something, a lot of desire, fire in your stomach, passion. What is this? Yin ener yang energy. Uh, conformity. Universal laws. Uh, societal rules. Social rules. Following social rules. Or not following social rules. <clears throat> the thinking woman. A woman of wisdom or understanding. Anxiety. Stress. Worry. Worried about some woman. Door to value. New beginnings in finance or career. Influx of money here. A deep knowing, empathy, a hypersensitive and a higher power. Being at the ready here. There is some strategy or thinking or analyzing going on. And then the heart chakra and another heart. So let's see what's up for Scorpio. All right, the Hierophant has to do with a relationship and or like getting in line, follow the rules. If you don't like to follow the rules, all right, what is going on here? Somebody is being expected to conform or wants the universe help them conform, is trying to bend and mold something to its liking, to your liking. Nine of Cups, right? To your liking. Your wishes, your working on manifesting them and making them just right. Eight of Pentacles, it's not easy, Ten of Cups, because you want this long-term special love and connection um, to keep going smoothly, the Wheel of Fortune here. Oh, shit. So, <clears throat> life force energy, strength and the star. So, like, Love, courage, falling in love, peace, healing, healer, wishes being fulfilled here because of your will, Nine of Swords, because of your courage, because of that fire that you just keep feeding. Exactly, the King of Wands. Just keep feeding it. The emperor. I feel like you're asking the universe, because the Wheel of Fortune is right behind there. Uh, our Father, God, um, for just the right package. Just the right beginning, just the, somebody has all the right stuff. Isn't that a song? New Kids on the Block. Nine of Wands, Judgment. You're like, please, 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 please. And this person uh, is just as has a fire burning for you too. Someone's been through a lot of stuff here. Two of wands. Carry it with them. Four of swords. Six of cups. The past. It's always with them. 
part of them. This person is like, has an empty nest, is an empty nester. What is this right here by the book? The elephants and the universal laws and shits, eight of swords. Yeah, two of swords, not wanting to conform, feeling stuck and bound by earthly laws or the inability to get out of your own head for some reason about society. The Wheel of Fortune. Wanting to know, like, how long am I going to be stuck here? And if I'm going to be stuck here, can you please give me the things I asked for, Two of Pentacles? Could, could you please? Because this shit is too much, the Tower. It's just too much. And I just saw the King of Swords, Five of Cups. I need a new beginning, I need a new spark, I need a message, can you hear me, Nine of Swords? Please tell me you hear me, I don't wanna be without this, I don't wanna do without this, what is this? Nine of Cups, I don't wanna. And contact here, Two of Swords, like Ten of Swords, you are afraid of losing something. Eight and two is 10. You're trying to, Nine of Cups, get your point across here, High Priestess, to the universe that you want something for long term, that <coughs> you're, four, Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands, you're invested to give and receive, or give an Empress here, uh, till the death, Three of Swords, I feel like you'd be heartbroken if, this didn't come to fruition, or if this lover disappeared. How did I do this? Um, normally I just put them back, but a bunch of them are like that. I don't really know why. All right, so all this wishing here, you are doing Ace of Pentacles for this gift has been hard manifestation but you're winning the sun you're getting what you asked for three of cups you're able to celebrate a win small victories what is this right here with the thinking woman the hermit the thinking woman somebody that is oh this is funny all right so the eight of cups is like the hermit card sort of it's like the hermit going on the adventure or before it's, it's similar is my point okay so somebody had left this woman left a situation here hermit that was very stressful it was a nightmare they had to walk away temperance in order to temper a situation someone had to like leave a contract behind ace of swords seven of six of swords is a seven of swords which is because somebody was lied to or cheated on or something happened justice virgo libra leo pisces Leo, Aquarius, Aries. So cause and effect. So because somebody had to walk away, because some woman had to walk away from something and learn some lesson and awaken after some nightmare, they're like page of pentacles. Yeah, learn some lesson. And settle themselves in queen of pentacles long term get themselves grounded empress can i have another one death and rebirth the devil good golly so i don't know obsessed here with some sort of rebirth after a death or 
to pick somebody up here, Page of Pentacles. Um, little gifts. I don't know. There's a couple gifts in here. Some sort of gifted situation. Can I have another one? Ten of Cups, Ace of Wands. Somebody is looking for like a, a life partner here. Ten of Wands. And I took like some crazy power here, temperance, to like make somebody like come back. Ten of Wands to the world, travel. Pack their shit up. So what is this here? The Six of Pentacles. Yeah, influx of money here. Eight of Wands. Fast, fast, fast movement, fast travel, fast changes, fast messaging or messages here. After nothing, Four of Cups. After nothing coming along, all of a sudden, the Page of Swords, everything that you have been wanting, Ace of Swords, that you've been thinking about, that you've been studying about, that you have been inquiring about, that you've been watching here, someone from the past that you are, are watching, have been watching, taking a leap of faith, making an offer, Emperor, Hierophant, Lovers here. Reconciling. After a loss. Emperor and Empress out here. Yes, the time has come for that unique person and that key experience and the forward movement that you've been astro traveling thinking about visiting a soulmate and a faithful companion here this winter trust your gut here Ex a lot of passion shit scorpio a lot of fire that's that fire burning in your stomach you want to do things get them done uh problem solving adaptive Resourceful and Empress. So Scorpio and Libra right there next to each other. Strong sexual desire. Uh, allow, trust, divine timing. It's all about divine timing and spiritual partnership here. Help me. Spell work. Manifesting the things here. Tornado. Manifesting somebody to come towards you, temperance, more alchemy. Purpose-driven and a victory. You win the Celtic knot, unconditional love. You get to do something again. You get some divine union uh, directly on your path and enduring a love of a lifetime. What is this? Star, peace, love of a lifetime, a dream come true. Arriving, transforming, changing, renewing. Somebody had to move. There's some sort of moving energy for this to happen. Like you, you moved a mountain. Libra. Forces of the universe. You employed the universe to work with you, to move the mountain, to make somebody chariot arrive, cancer. The tree, a meeting, an event, a party, connection to source, personal growth, health and vitality. This meeting, this event helps ground you, helps heal you. This meeting up is like a past life thing here. 
you know, I'll meet you uh, at, you know, 2.05 on Thursday, 2023, January 22nd, blah, 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 and then more resources, yes? And Libra's still at the bottom of the deck. So, commerce, working together, multiplying. Your higher self is very excited here, yippee skippy. Uh, what else? If something is enduring, that there's stability as above, so below. A lot of working together to get this done. Cohesion, it's perfect timing. That's what I said. I'll meet you at this place in time. Let's see if we can do it. That's what this is. Role play. Cosplay. Reincarnation. Oh, great. A reptile here, yin and yang, justice, ooh. Bullies. Shedding skin seems extremely relevant. Newness, awakening, healing. Signs and symbols, that does say yin and yang. A priest, a high priestess. Uh, hierarchy, inquisition, shaman, best friends, soulmates, reason, analysis, common sense, intelligence, sanity, chess game, mediator, superstition. What is <laughs> A manhunt. Somebody has been looking for someone or they've searched high and low. <sighs> There's not a lot of people with knowledge and common sense or uh, that see the world or reality hypothesis the same way that you do with all these criminals around and repeat offenders. People think they know some shits. So you feel like you're stuck in the middle of this poisonous world and you're just trying to manifest justice. You're just trying to play by the rules and... Hmm. But other people don't want to play by the rules here. Could be checking out some nude pictures while you're manifesting your love. Infatuated with someone. Theater. Save the world. I was just thinking, like, and teacher came out. There's a lot of learning from one another or something about a school play might be relevant. Premiere. Spotlight. Woo! Whoa, Nelly. Armageddon, an epic battle, a joint effort. Mentor. Big city. Lecturing, parenting, Jack in the Box, which is Pandora's Box here. Oh, and it's out anyways. Gossip. There's gossip of Pandora's Box being opened here. Something is like Shakespearean. It's like unreal. A lot of theater everywhere. People are not who they claim to be. They're a bunch of snakes. A lot of composing and crafting, people using people as muses and something about galleries and shit. Somebody, social media and bad reputation, keeping a secret, gambling. Oh, God. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. There's some sort of kidnapping thing floating around, too. Bribery and money and other weird shit floating around this. Maybe it has to do with that 
emptiness, the empty nester where she's holding a place with that heart. Let's see real quick. It's easy to appreciate something until you've almost lost it. So definitely manifesting something to come back uh, and stay in your life. It's taken a lot of work and a lot of power and a lot of magic. Shape up or ship out. What a plot twist you were. I feel like you were be able to move people out of your way and separate them in order to get the things that you wanted. Dark magic. Oh, geez. You had to move the darkness out of the way. In the world and its desire are passing away, but for those who do the will of God will live forever. Yeah, you all been here and done this over and over again with each other's psychic abilities. <clears throat> Never believe you're above anyone. Keep a humble spirit. Always work as a team. The queen bee has no stinger, but she has backup. It's a lot of spiritual backup here. I failed over and over and over, and that's why I have success. So what was a failure is now successful. What once was wrong is now right. Always watch your watchers. It's better to seek forgiveness than ask permission here. Somebody wants forgiveness of something. Be a warrior, not a warrior. I think it has to be spiritual people and team and guidance. Vibes don't lie. There's something wonky going on. Sometimes we mature with, with damage, not with years. Money is the root to all evil. There is something lurking around here. Then it wants to creep in your environment. It wants to take over. Some missing person is the key. They have been the key here. Something is getting to be down to the wire. It's that broken heart is in the student. Broken hearted about a student. X marks the spot. Something is about to be brought back to life, having possibly to do with a child. Countdown to doom. It's just a matter of time before this pops up and it's in your world. X marks the spot, right? Pops up. It's in your world. Shit. Mythological creature, a very important person. Until then, it has just been that, like, a mythological creature. This hasn't been in your face or anything. You've only, like, heard about it. Ooh. Yikes. I can't get away from this grave, but that is your card, Scorpio. Death. Unknown here. Family history. Collateral damage. So somebody has been damaged by, like, life. Somebody tried to demolish someone here. Someone wants to come see this very important person after a scandal. Somebody is stalking someone here. Somebody is uh, natives, like tribe. Stop the press. Morning. Somebody is very sad about their loss of this person. The broken hearts, the broken hearts, the broken hearts. Somebody needs a vacation. They're like circling around. They want to know how they can write an injustice. They might type some things out on the computer and then delete, delete, delete. I feel like they're not getting sent here. Poverty. Somebody doesn't know how to come forward. Secret life. Um, somebody is these, has been seen as inconsequential. Maybe the celebrity, this very important person here. But there are some adoring crowds that are very sad that <clears throat> are lurking. Intelligence. Watching. Gathering information. They might even feel stupid on the outside for forcing people on the outside. A lot of outsider energy. All right. 
That's all I got, Scorpio. So until next time, bye.